Hey guys, this might be a terrible idea for a uh-oh bro, but let's look up funny x-rays. Listen man, you gotta stop sticking phones up your butt. Oh, that looks lovely. <laughs> I'm sure they're fine though, right? They just can't say habitat. <laughs> Do you have a bottle stuck inside you? Lovely. <laughs> just so you guys know, the bottle creates a suction, so you never want to do that. Because once there's a suction, you can't pull it out, otherwise you'll hurt yourself. The solution is you gotta drill a hole in the bottom of the bottle so the air escapes. How do I know that? Shut up. You got nailed. Ugh. Uh, bling bling. What? Why do you have silverware inside of you? <laughs> yeah, not so hot anymore, huh? If there was an x-ray of me right now, everyone would just start screaming. <laughs> what is that? Wait, is that the thing you use for gas? That can't be real. There's no way. Oh yeah, that looks real good. Only not. Because you practically have the same skeleton as a boy. <laughs> Why are dogs so stupid? They will eat anything. Okay, I don't know about that one though. A toy car? Really? <laughs> Yo, this is Dr. Dre and this is my x-ray. To fans, I'm hospitable even at the hospital. Smoking looks dumber than ever before. Side note, why do we have so few bones in our neck? You think we'd have like a front spine and a rear spine and a side spine? Whatever. Yes, it works. Uh, I have a question. Why did you leave it in their butt for an x-ray? Well, that takes away all the romance. We're really just skeletons smacking our faces together. X-ray photobombing. <laughs> why does she have brains on her butt? Butt brains. She like thinks with her butt? I don't even get it. What is this, Bruce Willis? You know, if that's actually what's under there, you might want to talk to your surgeon. <laughs> um, I asked for fun bags, not basketballs. Okay, that's just rude. So there's a demon inside of you, specifically in your butt. You have a demon in your butt. You know how you get an x-ray like this? You just put your hand on top of a nail. <laughs> Wait, they're saying this is George Bush? Excuse me, Dad, aka George Bush Sr. I just wanted you to witness me sticking a crayon up in my nose. And yeah, yeah, I love Texas, and Texas is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what they mean when they call you a blankhead. A blankhead! Hey, smaller doesn't necessarily mean less capable. Like, for instance, I'm pretty sure a house cat could outsmart a hippopotamus. There there you go. How did you even get it up that far? I get the stock halfway in thing, but all the, really? Did you just have a baby or? More basketballs. That's a heck of a sponsorship deal though. A celebrity being so dedicated, they put your product inside of them. What is with the freaking silverware, people? Homer Simpson 2.0. <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> Gotta come up with a new excuse. Oh, glandular. Okay. Hey, it could be a legit condition. You don't know. Well, it's my understanding they call them wisdom teeth because they come later on in life when you're more wise. The teeth themselves are by definition retards. <laughs> My teeth really stick out like that. It looks so stupid. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Uh oh bro, this was weird, right? Bye. <laughs>